Hey guys! This is Cartoon Recapped. Today we'll show you a 2021 musical family cartoon called Sing 2. Be aware of heavy spoilers. Sit back and enjoy the show. Sometime after the events of the first film, Buster Moon is thriving in Caledonia with his newly rebuilt theater, with Johnny, Nina, Rosita, Gunter, and Miss Crawley working as his cast and crew while Ash performs as a soloist. They fail to impress Suki Lane, a talent scout dog working at Crystal Entertainment, who tells Buster he would not make it in nearby Redshore City. Encouraged by Nana Noodle Man, Buster reunites his crew, and they head off to the city to make an impression. They are denied entry into Crystal Entertainment, but manage to sneak in for an audition with entertainment mogul wolf Jimmy Crystal. As Jimmy is uninterested in Buster's original show pitch, Gunter suggests a space-themed sci-fi musical that features songs from Clay Calloway, a legendary rock star lion who has not been seen in 15 years after his wife Ruby died. Intrigued and assuming Clay will be a part of the show, Jimmy Green lights it and lets Buster and the crew stay at his hotel during production. Rosita's husband Norman and their piglets later show up at the hotel room to stay. Miss Crawley finds where Clay lives and goes to visit him, but he scares her away with a series of booby traps. During a rehearsal, Rosita develops a fear of heights, prompting Buster to give Rosita's role to Jimmy's daughter, Portia, on his insistence while Rosita is assigned to a minor role. Meanwhile, Johnny has been assigned to work with top choreographer Probasa's monkey Klaus Kickenklober, but his harsh teaching methods leave Johnny unable to learn effectively and leads Johnny to believe that Klaus dislikes him. Johnny later comes across a street dancer Lynx named Nishi, who agrees to help him out. Nina has been cast in a romantic scene with Darius, a self-absorbed actor Yak. Having never been in love before, Nina is unable to get the feelings across during their scene. She later meets and falls in love with an ice cream vendor elephant named Alfonso. Jimmy eventually finds out that Buster never contacted Clay about the show and threatens to harm Buster if he does not deliver. Ash and Buster visit Clay instead to convince him to be in the show. He refuses at first, but Ash changes his mind. Back at the theater, Buster asks Portia to switch roles with Rosita, as Portia's acting skills are poor. A distraught Portia misinterprets this as Buster firing her and runs off. News of the incident is soon broadcast on television. Outraged upon learning this, Jimmy then nearly drops Buster off his penthouse roof before locking him in a closet. Suki later frees Buster and warns him to leave Red Shore City before Jimmy can kill him. Ash arrives at the hotel room with the crew and Clay, who advises Buster not to run and hide as he did. Buster decides to have the cast and crew put on the show that night behind Jimmy's back after he witnesses Jimmy insulting him and his friends on television. Portia rejoins the show, Johnny calls his dad and his gang to come over and help keep Jimmy and his bodyguards at bay, and Rosita calls Norman to let the piglets run free on one of the hotel floors to distract security. During the show, a jealous Klaus takes the place of Johnny's performance partner in an attempt to undermine his number, but Johnny defeats Klaus with encouragement from Mushi and the other dancers, finally earning Klaus respect. Portia performs a high-energy song and dance number, standing up to Jimmy, angering him. Nina visualizes Darius as Alfonso and successfully performs a romantic duet with him. In a last attempt to stop the show, Jimmy drops Buster off a high catwalk, which forces Rosita to overcome her fear of heights to save Buster. When the time comes for Clay to take the stage, he claims that he is not ready yet. Ash leads the crowd in a rendition of one of Clay's songs, giving him the courage to perform. After the curtain call, Jimmy tries to take credit for the show but is arrested by the police for attempting to kill Buster. Just as Buster and his friends, now including Portia, Clay, and Nushi, begin to return home the following morning, Suki stops them and tells them that a major theater wants to put on their show. As the cast puts on its first official performance, Buster watches from the VIP section, proud to have succeeded in Red Shore City. Thanks for watching. Hope you all enjoyed and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.